in today's video i'm going to show you how to put screen recording inside your iphone using CapCut and InShot app completely for free and it's super easy to do just like this one so keep watching first things first we'll need a couple of things for this tutorial a screen recording of our video a background photo an iphone png CapCut and InShot app step one add a screen recording Open up CapCut and import your screen recording. Slide to the left and tap on Format. Here, you can change the ratio of your video, whether it's YouTube, Instagram, Shorts or Reels. Choose any size you want and then go back. For this example, I'm going to choose 9x16. And use both fingers to resize your video because of the watermarks surrounding the video i like to do this so my viewers can see the video clearly and follow along so don't forget to zoom out your video step two add your background photo to change the background go back again and tap on canvas tap on color to change the background to a solid color You can also select any color from your video. To add a custom background, tap on the check mark and click on background. Tap on the photo icon to select an image from your camera roll. You can always change the background to any image you want. Step 3. Add a PNG image. Go back to the beginning of the video, tap on overlay and add an iPhone PNG. Then increase the size. You can get this by searching on Google. Make sure you download the one with a transparent background. If you don't get a transparent background, just save the photo to your gallery. Open up your Razer app and add a photo. Tap on Erase, Target Area, and then tap on the white areas to delete the white background. Tap on Done and save it to your phone. And it saves it as a PNG image. That's how you get an iPhone PNG. For an easier method, go to PixArt, select the transparent background, and then just search for iPhone PNG. Click on Apply and save it to your phone. This method is simple and easy. Now zoom it in and position it on top of the video. Drag it all the way to the end of the video and that's it. You can split certain parts of the video. Add text and delete the parts you don't like. And that's how you put screen recording inside an iPhone using CapCut app. Here's a second way to do this with InShot app. Step 1. Add a screen recording. Go to InShot app and tap on New to select your screen recording. Tap on Canvas to change the ratio.
Now I'll tap on zoom and use the slider to zoom out the video. You can use both fingers to zoom out the video too. Step 2. Add your background photo. Tap on background and choose any background color you want. There are so many options here. You can even select gradient, pattern or texture. Add your own background photo. Tap on the photo icon and add your background photo. Tap on the check mark to go back and then add an iPhone PNG image. Step 3 Add an iPhone PNG image. Click on PIP and add a PNG image. Zoom it in and put it at the end of the video. You can also split, add text, delete the part you don't like and edit it however you want. That's how you put screen recording inside an iPhone using CapCut and InShot app. Bonus tip, you can download cute aesthetic backgrounds from Pinterest. Just open up Pinterest and search for cute background aesthetic. And you will find so many backgrounds. Tap on the one that you like and download it to your phone. To recap, record your screen first, download cute aesthetic background from Pinterest, and get your iPhone PNG image from Google or PixArt. Make sure you get one with a transparent background. In case you don't get a transparent image from the internet, use the Razer app to remove the white background. Finally, edit with InShot or CapCut. If you want to spice up your videos, check out this video next. You are going to see a cool way to add stop motion effects to your videos using CapCut. See you there.